channel and I'm here with a guest, a young YouTuber and I want you to introduce him, sir. Yes, I'm, I'm Dimasi Lawrence. Yeah, what kind of videos do you do? Like, uh, what do you do? Just explain a little bit to me now. Okay, I do short plays, huh? Witty short plays. Witty, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> you have to explain. <laughs> you have to explain. 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 Check, check my channel. Yeah? Witty, Watch the video. Witty means funny. Not too funny. Okay. Funny is comic. And what is the meaning of wit? Wit, yeah? Wit. Okay. So you just need to go and check his channel so that you find out the meaning of it. I don't know. Maybe I'll Google it. I'll Google it later on. Mm -hmm. So why did you do it? YouTube is fun. Eh? I've always wanted to make videos from long, long time ago. But you see, when opportunities present themselves, like now we have this platform. Yeah. Just have to do what we have to do. So, like, is there anyone who inspired you to start yeah, your channel? And uh, what what are you looking forward to in the near future when it comes to the kind of videos that you are making? There are lots of people who do some nice work, yeah? We have so many YouTubers in Kenya who are doing it big. I don't know whether I'll mention all the names, but... Maybe you can mention a few. That <laughs> <laughs> there are so many. I don't know where I can start from. But, okay, Kenyan YouTubers are doing a lot of good work. Yes. So, yeah, so how do you see your channel in the near future? I think I'm going to grow. Yeah, I'm going to grow so fast and I'm going to get monetized. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> I think everyone who starts a YouTube channel, they just look forward to monetization. Yeah. So also, if you can share with us some of the challenges that uh, young YouTubers face in the business. Okay, first of all, the, the biggest challenge is know-how. You know, sometimes you may have that idea of what you want to talk about, but you don't know what you're supposed to be doing like when it comes to editing, what are you supposed to include, what are you supposed to be omitting. Then another thing, sometimes people look for better chances to do the videos. You'll find some YouTubers want to have the big cameras, they want to have a budget, a very big budget to bring these things, but I don't think that is right. The best thing is just to use whatever you have. You know, most people don't think you can make, you can use your phone eh, to make very high quality videos like I do. I do everything on my phone. I have a computer, but I prefer using my phone because I can carry it wherever I'm going. Even in the bush where there's no power. Once, once it's charged, then I have also my power bank. Yeah, I'm good to go. Like, I couldn't believe that you use your phone mm -hmm. until I saw it. I thought you had a camera because your videos are very clear. There's only one video I used a camera, which I, I hired, yeah? mm -hmm. but it was a hectic time. I really had to, because it was my first time to use this big camera. I could not afford, because I was just starting up, I could not afford paying this guy for the camera and having him come to record the videos. So I preferred paying him the fee for the day, which was 1500 wow. that It's a lot. <laughs> for a young yeah. YouTuber, it's a lot, maybe. Then the funny thing he did, he ensured he never gave me enough power that could last me more mm -hmm. than one day. So he remained with the charger, then the battery he gave me could only last one day. So once I was done recording, I just transferred those, those uh, footages to my computer. Editing was not too, so easy, because the quality, quality of the videos were also not as good as my phone's mm -hmm. quality. So you hired the camera, not the person doing the video. I hired the camera and oh. I became the camera man. <laughs> Interesting. Mm -hmm. So maybe if you can share how you edit your videos, maybe the software that you use, if you plan to change that anytime soon. Okay, for the moment I'm using a light software called Vinshot. My friends tell me it does not, it doesn't have so many effects, but for now it's serving me. At first, I used uh, another software called Vlogit. I think it's called Vlogit. When I was doing my first video, my very first video about cockroaches, yeah, mm -hmm. I would edit it seven times. Wow. So after I would, I would edit, then at the end of the editing, when I'm trying to save, the software crashes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that was just so, so heartbreaking. I have never felt any heartbreak worse than that one in my YouTube journey. That is the worst one. <laughs> cockroach. You edited cockroach seven times. I know. 
I thought maybe the footage is not okay because you know I I was t- I was literally going after the cockroaches at night. I switched off the lights. <laughs> then I ran after the cockroaches with my phone. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. So even if you watch it at the end of the video, you can see there's lip syncing. Mm-hmm. You just see the lips moving, but you cannot get the words. Oh. On the original video, you could hear everything I was talk- I was saying. Yeah? Mm-hmm. But when I uploaded the video. <laughs> I realized that it was blank at the end of it. Wow. Mm-hmm.